Mazagin dock shipbuilders and the Indian Navy have initiated the design work for a new class of hunter killer diesel electric submarines, and the detailed engineering design will be completed by 2028, and the construction on the indigenous submarines will commence from 2032 onwards. The upcoming submarine will have a submerged displacement of less than 3,000 tons, and will be based on the technology obtained from the Calvary class submarines, and will incorporate 70% indigenous technologies, including air independent propulsion system, vertical launch system modules, and unmanned underwater vehicles. The Argentine Defense Minister has arrived in New Delhi, where the sale of 16 Tejas Mark 1A light combat aircraft is expected to come up. Interestingly, the Argentine Defense Minister also visited Brahmo's facility, and the Argentinian side showed keen interest in acquiring the Brahmo's missile, which has already been ordered by Philippines. As Argentina engages in talks with Indian officials over the BrahMos missile, experts have said that BrahMos missile would bolster its military capabilities and also foster regional stability, and this avenue of collaboration could serve as a catalyst for further partnerships in other strategic sectors. While India has announced plans to procure 26 Rafale Marine fighter jets for its navy, but media reports indicate that the deal with France is expected to be concluded after the upcoming general elections in May 2023, as the government appears determined to avoid any potential opposition backlash ahead of the elections. While the naval procurement is in progress, the Indian Air Force is also gearing up to procure 114 fighter jets, in which the Rafale has emerged as the front-runner. France's Safran Group is working on a heavily modified M88 engine to power its sixth-generation fighter jet prototype, and the same engine is expected to serve as the base for the development of the Indo-French engine for AMCA fighter jet program. India's AMCA program requires an engine capable of generating 75 kN of dry thrust and 120 kN wet thrust. The new engine will also be offered to the Rafale aircraft of the French Air Force, and eventually find its way to other operators of the Rafale aircraft including India. Aeronautical Development Establishment is set to design an autonomous ship-based reconnaissance drone, that will be capable of vertical takeoff and landing. It will be a runway independent and cost efficient drone with mission radius range of 150 km and 20 kg payload capability, that will allow the integration of advanced sensor systems to perform reconnaissance and intelligence collection, as well as ship to shore logistics support. After the decision to buy 31 Predator drones from the US, Indian Armed Forces are set to acquire 97 Tapas drones under the Make in India project, for surveillance purposes along China and Pakistan borders. A joint scientific study was carried out by the Defence Forces, and it has been decided that they need 97 medium-altitude long-endurance drones for their requirements, that will cost around 10,000 crore rupees and the Indian Air Force will be the lead service for the procurement.